It's unusual to have a midterm election be this um, competitive, to have this many incumbents be threatened. Um, typically in this midterm election, they're not just threatened but might actually lose. They're facing a lot of credible challengers. Um, it is, uh, I think, exceptional to be this close to the election and have this many races still either undecided or tipping towards the challenger, not the incumbent it is a, a real sea change election. Ultimately, I think this election seems at this point to be one that's going to produce divided government. It seems like Democrats are going to lose control of the House. Um, they m probably will control, well, they stand an even chance at this point of controlling the Senate, and I think actually they'll pull out the Senate. Um, and that means basically they'll be sharing the public stage and sharing control of the legislative and political agenda with Republicans. When you lose the majority, you lose your staff or you lose a large proportion of your staff. The majority, especially in the House, doesn't play fair. They stack committees in their favor. They control the legislative calendar. So things that the Republican Congress doesn't want to see get done won't get done. Um, so Democrats laboring in obscurity in Congress are going to be living an unfortunate life. They'll also have difficulty getting public attention. When there's fights with Congress and the news media have to choose between showing members of Congress disagreeing with the Republicans versus Obama, they'd rather go to the White House, they'd rather go to the larger figure. So in effect, he'll be, he'll be stealing their limelight for the next two years minimum. And uh, they'll have a difficult time unless they go against Obama, building a brand that's independent of uh, his and defining themselves. Mm -hmm.